Hi guys, today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on this. I don't really know what it's called, but it's kind of like, um, like a funky sort of print. And it's really, really simple and easy. I don't know if you can really like see that properly. But it's just like blobs and then lines going down and I'll um, put all my links and everything and there'll be pictures down below so that you can see everything better. So yeah, what I've got is Mint Green by Barry M as my um, base coat. So that's, yeah. And then I've got White, which is like the blob this blob here it's so just any old white and then you can choose whatever colour you want but I thought these two went quite well so this is my other colour and it's bright purple the barium that goes on top of the white and then I've got black Maybelline Express and a thin brush and a plastic so that's all you're going to need, it's really really quick, really really simple, and I will just show you how to do it. Okay, so once you've painted all of your nails, your base colour, mine's mint green, you want to take your white and do two, or if you want to do one big sort of, just like, Blodge, like a triangly shaped splodge, like that kind of. Doesn't have to be like perfect because you're going to put paint on top of it anyway. So we just have like a splodge here and another little one here. So, once you've done that, you take your purple and you're going to do a splodge inside. So, it doesn't have to be the same shape or anything. So, this is really great because you don't need to use a brush particularly. You just use the one that comes with the paint. So, like that. Like that, just inside the white, and then you want to wait for it to dry because all of the layers they get quite thick and it takes too long, and the paint will just smudge. Now I'm going to take the black, and you're going to do like a little splodge inside the purple. So, I don't know if you can see, but it's white, purple and black now. So the next thing you want to do is take your bit of plastic and put a small blob of black onto the plastic. And then we're just going to use the brush, you don't need a lot on the brush, to just go on top of the white and do just like lines, like strokes, and they can be like all different lengths, different spaces apart. So it looks jaggedy and rough. Like that. So 
just do it to the other one. like so. so that's it I really hope you found this easy and you enjoyed it this is what they finally looked like I will take pictures and put them on my Facebook page so yeah that will be in the down bar and I haven't done a tutorial for a while but I've not really been sure as what to do so it would be really great if you like gave me some requests and everything so that I can do something that you all really want to watch. Okay, see you next time. Bye!